Hi everyone. Let us um, provide a solution to this problem. We have square root of 3 square root of x equals 2. And um, here is what I want to do. I want to square this side and then I will square the right hand side. By the way, if you are new to this channel, subscribe so you can get more of my videos. And I'm also very aware that a couple of you are not new to this channel and you have not subscribed. Please subscribe. Now, if you square this, this and this will cancel each other. So we have 3 root x on the left. On the right, we have 4. Now, what again do I do? Because of this square, I would have to, because of this square root, I would have to square this again. And I would definitely square this as well. But this square now is for 3 and root x. So 3 squared will give 9. Then this can now go, we'll just multiply this by x. And it's equal to 4 squared, which will give 16. 9 times x is 9x, and that is equal to 16. And then we divide both sides by the coefficient of x, and that is 9. So this will go into that. Now, our x is just 16 divided by 9. And I, be I believe you know what we always do. Let's go into verification. Okay. And um, I, bet, I bet you, you're going to learn from there as well. The equation is square root of 3 square root, square root of x equals 2. Now, I'm going to put this in place of x. So we have square root of 3. Now, square root of 16 divided by 9. Will this give me 2? Let's look at this very quickly. So we're going to have square root of three. Then square root of um square root of sixteen over nine. We can decide to find the square root of sixteen and get four over the square root of nine and then we get three. Right? And again, these three can just go there. So what we'll be having now is 1 times 4, and that is 4. So we have square root of 4 on the left. And square root of 4 is just equal to 2. That is the same 2 we had over there. So this is the confirmation that x equals 16 over 9 satisfies the equation. Thank you for watching, and if you've not subscribed, please subscribe.